Are you authorized? I'm always authorized. Okay. <laughs> Who is Arthur and why does he have we never I was Billy, I was so sort of Billy and so and basically similar to this what they call Joe Pepper. Another turtle, he had a seventy had the band with the seventy had written in front of had a you know like a as you can see, historic and scale model kits are a big thing in these kind of shows. They sell like hotcakes. This gentleman's selling some beautiful plants, actually, that's what he's known for making. And these beautiful ones, oh, which actually it looks like I might have to pick up a couple of those. Oh, these are my friend Mike Meehan's figures. Definitely got to get some of those. Now, I know it looks quiet here in the video, but it's only because I waited until people went to lunch. Otherwise, I would have been pushing through a bunch of people just to show you around, and that would not have been fun. This guy has the most stuff. He has the largest space. And well deserved because he's got lots of good stuff. State stale stuff. You end up finding a lot of these in these kind of uh, smaller shows because a lot of the guys in this hobby are older, of course, so we all know what comes with older, besides senior citizen discounts, is unfortunately, eventually, they pass away. That was like a laser. Here is the exhibitor room where all the competition pieces are. Currently, there are judges judging, a lot of people looking. There's, there's more people at the show, just a lot of them went to lunch. But in between is when people come and look at all the exhibitor pieces too and take photos and things like that. So I'll show you around here real quick. See all the painted stuff. <laughs> the mad guys, don't touch the exhibits. That's a good rule. <laughs> oh, that is super duper cool and could have definitely used some more weathering. I would have had a field day weathering that for sure. I apologize, please excuse me. I'm showing the good people all the good stuff everybody painted. Hey, if you do, don't worry. They're all they're all adults. <laughs> some good, there's some good work here. Some oh yeah, for sure. Here, this is by my friend Mike Meehan. He's also known as Milos if you're on uh, Cool Mini and Not and stuff. He is a fantastic painter. These are also his models too. He started a line of models. He's very into painting chicks and stuff. And these are his models. And I think that's where some of my money is going to be going today. It's my friend Glenn's area right here. He, he's very into painting flats, which you can get from Littleton Soldier. You can get that site. And he did some models, beautiful stuff. Very proud of him. David Wiggins. Oh, he got some flats too. That's really cool. 
have that Strahd figure in that wall for me. It's not mine, but my friend Bruce painted it. He's part of the North Texas Figure Club, too. Yeah, that's already painted. These are the pieces I put in. Oh, yeah, I still want a bet. I figure I'll just see how they that's do. That's the one I like. I like that. The gentleman I just met named Aaron painted those. Not Aaron, but it's my different Aaron. Excuse me. Ooh, Star Wars one. We have to go look at that one. Da -da -da. Painted by a guy named Scott Freno. I hope I said the last name right. If I didn't, I'm sorry, don't tell me. Also, David Wiggins. No, 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 no. I, I know, but I, I, I'm not going to influence me. I just said some good work. Hey, let's look at more stuff. Hi, people, I don't know. Sorry, please excuse me one moment. No, that's all right. Thank you. I appreciate it. That's a cool diorama, right? You know he spent a lot of time on that. Oh, well, I mean... Gotta give props to the Millennium Falcon. Oh, and it glows! Look! Sorry, I get excited. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. Sure, but you may be able to take this one. Beautiful, huh? Those are mostly Andrea models, the Viking collection. Those are gorgeous. I love those. I have a few of those. I like Vikings. Just let the light hit it. He doesn't need an optimizer. Well, if, uh, we've got one. Okay. They're judging. I don't want to bother them. That's my friend Tom Williams' exhibit. He painted those. Aren't those cool? He did some flats, too. Did you get to see that? Uh, Jim Stutes, I don't, or, or Stute, I don't think I know him, but he did pretty much all flats. Ooh, one more I gotta show you, one more exhibit. Hello, sir. And that's by Bob Davis. Ooh, that's Moreland Studios, I have that one. And he did some flats too. Oh, look at that steampunk chick. I love that use of bright colors and monotone, monochrome, rather, sorry. Good use of OSO on that. Look at this Tooth Fairy one. That's definitely by far like one of my favorite things. I have to tell you that. And that's what we got in the exhibit room. There's a couple of pieces I couldn't show you because people are judging. I don't want to bother them, rather. So.